Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is uh, Dungeon Souls with your host, Toast. And uh, I'll stop talking quietly. I'm sorry. I was trying trying something. I don't know. Uh, we're going to play some more Dungeon Souls. We're going to spend some of our money and points into these passives. That's going to make us a little bit more survivable. And uh, get right into it. Let's see what we have. Attack damage. It's percentage. Uh, stamina. Focus. Magic. Purity. Greed. Agility. Armor. I think I'm going to put some stuff into attack damage. And that's all we can do. What did that do for us? 4% damage increase. Cool. We played the Barbarian last time. Let's go back to our Archer. It's cool. You, if, you show, if you hover over these, it shows them. Uh, so there has to be a way to use them. I'm going to find out, you guys. I'm going to find out. We have a chest here with a book that's going to give us uh, five bonus damage. That's fantastic. Uh, already shaping us up to have a pretty good run. Yeah, look at that. We do nearly 10 damage on some of these enemies. That's a silver key. There's a silver chest up there, which we are absolutely going to go check out. And I think we have some nice uh, nice accuracy, good enough, I think, to, to deal with. So let's go ahead and put our put our experience here into, honestly, more damage. Let's use our, our key here, get a potion of rage, and a coin purse. That's plus 999 coins. That's fantastic. Uh, that puts our coin level already way up, um, past, uh, how many seals? Five, five marks activated. Okay. We're already richer than we were, I think, on previous rounds at the end. I'm definitely going to spend some money in the shop. We have the wealth for it, and luckily, and I'm going to say this and it's going to jinx me, but luckily there don't seem to be any kind of ranged, and then right away ranged, uh, creatures in here so we can just run in. Uh, and kill things. We don't have that much life. We only have 55 life. Let's go ahead and use a potion. Something attack me. Y'all need to die. Oh, I triggered a trap. Okay. Cool. What do we have? Bonus damage. Uh, penetration and health. Let's go for the bonus damage. Cool. And we'll we'll go ahead and we'll we'll trigger this and we'll use a potion of rage. Oh. That was maybe a revive. I think this is a potion of rage, yeah. So we do double damage now for 10 seconds, which clears that out really easily. No potions for us back there, which is a shame, but yeah, okay. And we can destroy those nasty pesky traps, which is gonna make it much easier in the future. Uh, I cannot shoot this guy's bullets out of the air. That would be a little bit overpowered, I think. Uh, there's some champion, uh, champion skeletons in this one, red dudes, fierce red dudes who are angry as all hell. But that's no problem. We got him. We got him. No problem. We leveled up. Let's check out what we can do here. Uh, I want I want those. I'm going to stop saying that every time we open up to level up. Our accuracy is good. Our speed is pretty good. Defense is probably good for survivability. But I'm thinking maybe... Oh, we put it into defense. Uh, and let's put one more damage into damage. One more point. So we got two defense and quite a bit of damage. Which is allowing us to pretty much two-shot most of these nasty imp dudes that uh, have been a problem for us in the past. Great. Got a necro down there. Uh, spawning eye hugger dudes. I don't know. They look like they want to run to you and give you a hug. Uh, the teleporter ones. Took out the weightlifting bro. And uh, here we Oh no! You guys, that was going to be such a good run. Ah, felt real good. Okay. Right back into it. Let's hit space and let's check our passives. So I want to know that uh, hitting quick restart adds to this amount. But first we're going to add... Um, we're going to increase health. Survivability. And we'll, we're going to keep keep with the archer for this, for this run. Watch the souls of the dead fill us as we enter the dungeon one more time. We got 5% movement speed, which is great for a ranger. We're going to trigger this trap, trigger this one, and we're going to run away. And instead of running away, we're <laughs> going to run into the things. Potion of Rage. That's pretty helpful. Uh, destroy the consumables, and this is why. Or destroy the uh, breakables, because it gets us health potions, which is going to make us 
much more likely to survive. I do not like this archer. At least this archer has lower defense. Yeah, let's activate it and fall back as much as we can. Whew. So, I, uh, I know there's a story to this game, some kind of background, and I think uh, that's available online. I don't know it quite yet, and uh, I think I'm definitely going to look into the lore uh, after this episode. So next episode, maybe I can talk to you guys about, you know, the premise behind the game, why we're uh, an adventure in this dungeon. It could be that we just want gold, but it could also be some other thing, because it looks like at the beginning we are we're our characters are dead. Uh, we've no longer, you know, we're no longer in the plane of the living, and maybe... We enter this dungeon as a chance to come back to life. This is a second chance for us. So if we can traverse the gauntlet and prove that we are the strongest soul, uh, we will survive and, and come back to life and live a glorious and rich life. But I don't know. I do.